is something there. Ah! Hello, my geek guys, guys, welcome back to more. Welcome to Hanway. I'm your host, Mask Geek. I am loving this game. Ooh. The fuck happened with the piano? That's dark. Da -da -da -da. That's dramatic. Oh, I got an itch on my ass. Okay, that's why I'm so jacked up. Jimmy, you need more lessons, man. All right, going straight on. Ooh, return here when you've collected all 100 DNA samples. What the fuck? Since when did Return to Hamel turn into Pac-Man? Hello? So do we get a... F oh. Of course we got a flashlight. I'm a dink. Hello? Huzzah! Buzzah! Uh, okay. Yeah. That's alright. All in order there. Hello, Operator! I'd like to place a clip. You've authorised the arrest of Isabel Miller. I'm going to need a copy of the arrest warrant you signed. A few of our residents who are familiar with your work have expressed concerns that you may be abusing the authority I have given you. Okay, cool. I was gonna say, I'd like to place a collect call to Domino's. This time they can pay for the fucking phone call as well as um, the pizza. Ever since I got rid of the barbecue stuffed crust. Man, my world doesn't exist anymore with the barbecue stuffed crust. It's so much more better with it. Hello? Anybody? Oh. That's not pretty. That's not how you take down a Christmas tree. You guys say anything, iPad? What is it? No, it's a galaxy phone. Daniel, I'm growing concerned with the doctor's actions. I know you work closely with him, but I'm also certain of your loyalty to our residents. Keep me posted on his latest research, will you? Sweet! I got me a phone like that! I fucking love it. <laughs> my galaxy phone. Best thing I've ever bought. Fucking expensive as well. Okay. Daniel, I left the mayor's letter and our final pieces of Miller's card in the safe. I won't be able to get it to her, so you may have to. If you forget the code, just remember, it's always an X. What fucking hell? I have too many cables, man. I feel like Johnny Mnemonic. So it's always the X, right? So it's XXXX. Okay, got it. I'm loving that plant. That, that actually looks really, really dirty. In a good way. Fucking awesome graphics. Right, so it's always an X. I've got to fucking play Pac-Man for the Doctor DNA. Of course, if I just find the Doctor and I'd have got to extract his DNA. Hopefully, I won't need to go to bed with him. I mean, look how shiny that freaking bed is. That linen. Jeez, if you lie on top of that bed straight after a shower, just slide straight back off. It'd be a slip and slide. <laughs> Anything? Well, there's got to be something in here somewhere. The pants? Is it? Nope, there, it's a coat. What did I just pick up? Did I just pick up some keys? Okay. Uh, excuse me, door. Thank you, fuck off. What the heck? What the fuck? Doctor DNA. Scattered across Hamill, the doctor's left preserved strands of his DNA, clipped it all and returned it to claim your reward. Fucking I'm entering the Matrix now? I just do not know what's happened there. Oh, it's gone dark. Right, it just powered down. It's gone to sleep. I got it. I thought maybe it would be also like some kind of plutonium thing from Back to the Future. Okay, nothing else. Oh, my Fuja lights died. Oh, flies, fuck off. So there's a limited number of batteries? Or at least limited number of flash of light juice? Uh, I'm gonna be so screwed. 
I must have picked up keys then. Hello? Housekeeping? Any more batteries? More batteries? No? Okay. Isabel Miller's card holders. Herself. Jail. Sam Nichols. Church. Taylor Walsh. Hospital. Walter Young. Power plant. Brett Chambers. School. I have one piece left for the mayor. Miller was the only class one citizen in zone three. Without her card, nobody can access the council building. Dun dun dun. Oh, hello. Can't see coming a big fucking baldness head. It goes to this side. It, it's always an X. One, two, oh. So it's crash, crash. What does that mean though? One, two, three, four. Is it duh, duh, duh? I don't fucking... Oh, I think I know. One, nine, three, seven. <laughs> fucking genius, man. I understood all it. The church has been added to your map. And I got an achievement for it for keeping the doors down. Sweet. Dear Mayor Lawson, here's a piece of Isabel Manor's citizenship card. You may we will be, will be, be you may we keep it print there. You may keep this as a reminder of what will happen to you should you oppose me. I split the card into six pieces and distributed them amongst citizens' most prominent citizens. You're the last. Hanwell belongs to me. <laughs> oh wait, no, I didn't write that down. Regards, the doctor. Okay, so the doctor's not a good man, I think. Ooh, the curtains matches the carpet. It's a fucking sex joke. All right. Daniel, I am currently at the council building and will remain here for the foreseeable future. I cannot stress enough how important it is that you remain inside my home. Keep the doors down and prepare for all types of anomaly. I promise your loyalty to the cause will be rewarded. And it starts tonight. Bum, bum, tonight, bum. The council will fall. Oh. I feel like I'm on the set of um, Guy Fawkes as he tries to take down the council. Hello. Bad, is it? Okay, yeah, cool. That's um, awesome. Moving on. There ain't no kind of crush on that PC. Oh, the flashlight recharges? Ooh. See, so if I keep it off for a little while, it recharges. That's a cool. Oh, that's my food steps. Okay. So I guess I still can't go through with this door then. Nope. So how many doctor pieces did I get from that? Uh, one. Just the one. So obviously then the this house is like a central location thing. And we can always come back here whenever we need to. Oh, by the way, I looked into the bit of uh, background of this game. It's an open-world survival horror, which is interesting. I wasn't expecting that when I was playing the demo. Ooh. Ooh. What is you? Is that the dig? Nope. Okay. Anomalies in your area. Prepare. Uh, prepare for what? We're going into Stalker Totri. I mean, uh, Shadow of Chernobyl. That game. That's where there's a load of anomalies. What's that? Oh, I just put from spooked my nose up at that already. Okay. Out backside we go. Yeah. Really not sure what to expect on this then. So. Now that I've Ukul explored this, can I actually go out the main door then without being fucking jump scared? <laughs> I'm gonna try it again. Probably gonna kill me again, but hey yo, whatever's. Press M to open the map. Ooh. Sweet. 
A piece of visible mass sits in the ship cat is known to be in the church. Ah. Was well, to move the map, tabs to display, and cue in the. Ah, that's cool. I bet we can go outside here now. So, when. You are now free to explore and do as you please. There are six pieces of Isabel Mia's citizenship card across Hanwell. You must find them all to gain access to the council. Okay. Right, sweet. We can't do it. It's a big massive prison city. It's Arkham City. Look how fucking big it is. This place is honking huge. I'm loving the music. I wonder how big this place is if you put it into a scale down thing. What is that? I bet this map is the actual fully rendered map that we see. It's like when you were, if you've ever played Elder Scrolls Skyrim and you open the map up of that, that map is the actual rendered world that you're in. Because I know that you can take down dragons in Skyrim and as their bodies burn away if you're quick enough and you open up the map you can actually see a small flicker of fire as to where that body's burning. So that's a live map of where you're playing so I wonder if this, this is the same kind of thing. This place is massive! Oh. Okay, so... A housing place? Yeah. So I reckon we do go out then, so we'll go out, swank a lift to that thing, whichever that is. Let's see if we can make our way over to the church. Do we have to stick to the roads? I doubt those are going to be walls. Then again, maybe there would be. Eh, we'll try it. If we get lost and died, we'll get lost and died. Don't have a lot of sprinters. At least I got zoomy eyes. I like that. Oh, hello. Yay! Hacky slashy. So now if this is going to be open world, that means I've got to do a lot of exploring, which means there's going to be probably a lot of boring bits, and I'm going to have to start cutting things out. So at least the video is still going to be entertaining. I don't really want to do that. I, mean, I don't really mind an open world horror. It's a long time since I played an open world horror. The last one I did was, as far as I can remember, Silencio Hill. Oh. And with the fog and everything, it kind of does look like Silent Hill as well. Ooh. Get a radio that goes hiss bang wallop. There's a monster nearby. Leg it. Yeah, I didn't even want to do this. I wanted to be able to have this uh, as. Ooh. It's raining. It's poodling that. Oh, it's gotten heavy. So if this is like this is open world, is there going to be the monsters out here? I think I can get to the church through here. Oh, stop that. Joy to the world, the love embrace. But chewing a good song. Ooh, handle a banking free cash withdrawal. Oh, I can't hack it. Wait. Oh, those are safe stations. See the save icon? That's a save station. Right. What about these? Can I find a collect call to Domino's for my fucking pizza? Sounds like some kind of beeping going on. Oh, the shadows move. Does this thing have a fucking day and night cycle? That's gonna be freaky and awesome cool at all at the same time. It's gonna be like dying light then. All the nasty zombros come out at night to chump or gobble you up. Clock Tower Street. Is that where I need to go? It is. 
So we're gonna go down this way. Look how cool it is. Wow. Definitely so British. What the hell? Okay. Gordon Freeman's fucking crowbar's just there on drugs floating in here. I see me some doctor dinner. That doctor's being spreaded as DIA. DIA? DIA? <laughs> ah, DNA all over the place like a dirty fucking re re weird, weird person thing. Alright, I'm just gonna slam it. I mean, this is even in a frozen container. Of all the not the dirty things it can be in. I don't really want to know what kind of DNA it is. Also, you may have noticed I've got some new cans on my head now. That's the re because the reason is, on Saturday just gone, at the time of recording this video, I did a live stream, but the audio kept cutting out. And I initially thought it's got something to do with the games not being able to load the sound files from the hard drive for some reason, which is really strange, because considering my entire PC now I'm now playing off is completely and utterly brand new. There's no second-hand parts in that, apart from the system memory, but that's all fully functional. So with that, I thought, you know, it could be an issue then with the USB audio drivers, which is a really strange thing, because after I did that, they, bleh, once I finished the live stream, even the Windows system sounds that play, you know, the dings, the dongs, and the bleeps, and the bloops, they were all stuttering as well, which is really strange. It couldn't have been a, a game issue. It must have been a sound drive issue. And I do know that with USB headphones, they need to load in their own sound, bleh, sound driver to be able to let Windows see that the headphones are connected every time you plug them in and have them removed as soon as you disconnect them. So it's like not always, um, it's like not an always on audio driver. Not like plugging your uh, headphones in like these are now. These are 3.5 millimeter standard um, analog audio headphones. I'm gonna have a look around and see if there's more dirty Dr. DNA around here. I was gonna try and do a live stream with them, but time constraints told me, nope, they ain't gonna be able to do that. So at the very least, I thought, you know what, I'll try what the, see what the audio is like of the he headphones. Just so uh, I'll play a game. And for the most part, they do seem alright. They've got a good set of uh, bass to them, good, nice, good thumping. So hopefully the next live stream is going to go so much more better. Building is protected. You cannot enter with a weapon. Alright, fine. How does I get one rid of it? Oh! Oh! Wee! Ha! <laughs> Sweet! Fucking Daisy all over again. Press Z for that. That's cool. Right, you be there, Mr. Handy. I'll be back for you. As long as Gone Freeman don't nick it. Oh, here we go. We're gonna meet our dear darling Dahlia Gillespie in here. Find the piece of Isabel Mars citizenship card. Yeah, I kind of knows that game. Kind of the objective ever since I got here. And I best stop flashing everywhere. It's always rude in church to flash. <laughs> That's beautiful graphics right there. Flashlight off, you get a reflection. Flashlight on, it disappears. Reflection doesn't disappear, but the um, saturation of the light just completely cancels out the reflective properties. That looks like there's a fucking horned cat sat on the desk. Do you think it looks like a fucking horned cat? So we can go to confessional. No, nope, father's not there. All right, can I go inside here? Ooh, I can. Hello, creepy. Scary spoople monsters. This is where the father would be. Thanks for agreeing to help out with a ritual. Today's hymns are extremely important. Be sure to keep a note of them before they are changed. And never forget, a painting is worth a thousand words. Cool. What about a doodle?
Sorry to cut off from the video you've just been watching, my geeky guys and gals, but the YouTube adpocalypse has hit home with a massive Thor-like hammer, including me. Now, a lot of my videos have been demonetized thanks to the wonderful gods of YouTube where they care more about their shareholders than the very creators that's been making their money all this time, but yeah, that's YouTube for you. So, while I have been putting links in the description to various other places you can go to, one of them is Patreon. So, if you have been liking my content and you want to be able to help support the channel, rather than clicking on the minuscule number of ads that pop up on YouTube and giving them a portion of your money, it would be welcome if you would click the Patreon link down below and donate that way. Now, I'm not asking for money. I'm not saying, not like, just do it. No, it's up to you. If you like the content and you want to help support the channel, click the Patreon link. And even if it's only a dollar, something like that, it's better than going to YouTube, isn't it? Don't you think? Now, back to the programming. What about a doodle? Sam, I don't know what you've been doing recently, but there's lots of noise about your church. We're getting calls every day about your state of mind. Now, while I understand the importance of faith in today's world, you must keep in mind that problems in Hanwell, well, they cannot be solved by superstitious rituals. Just leave it to the doctor. Look <laughs> at that with friends. Anyone else has locked in the wards by now? Sorry, sorry. To me, that is absolutely fucking perfect saying, is that? You can't go in because the church is protected and just leave it to the doctor to protect the church. The fucking hell. If ever anybody's watched Doctor Who, if you... I think it was... Um, there was... Um, what was it? David Tennant's first Christmas special when he was protecting the Earth against the Sycorax. And he said, This planet is protected! Before pressing a big red button. So that's fucking awesome. So that just reminded me about the doctor just there. Leave it to the doctor. I mean, obviously it's not going to be the David Tennant Doctor because the David Tennant Doctor doesn't fucking leave his dirty germ DNA all over the place like a fucking crazy person. Ooh. Okay. It ain't going to work, but let's try again. One, nine, three, seven. Nah. X doesn't mark the spot in this case. Ooh, could it be... That, 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 that. No. That, 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 that. Nah. I was thinking of the Father, Son and the Holy Ghost. Um, okay, we gotta find something else then. And people are worried about this uh, father's state of mind. Too much ceremonial wine in my mind. Never forget a painting is worth a thousand rages. So does that mean there's a painting that's gonna have the answer? I wonder if 6291 is the code. Given that they've got four hymn verses set out, but on each line one of the numbers has been taken, except for the first one. 6291, let's try that. Dee 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 dee. 6291. Fuck. There's me thinking I was a Jeebius. A piece of Isabel Miller's citizenship card is here, I should find it before leaving. So basically, I'm fucked. I'm screwed. I've got to stay in here until I find this freaking cut. Oh. There's the other side. Ah. Oh, then. So I wonder. Wait, no. The, the different way around. Why is there a different way around? 6291. Okay, so the first set of numbers are right. Oh, it fucking was 6291. Why didn't it work first time? I'm sure it was. That's what I did at first. You got a quee. I was just trying to think of any other possibility about what the code was from the outside. And I could not see it. The only key, uh, the only code I could see was six two nine one. I'm pretty sure that was the code the first time round. Yeah, well, at least we're done now. Now, now, casket. Okay, that's dark. Let's try the other door first. See if the confession alley. 
It can be open. We can. Ah, uh, poo-poos. <coughs> All right. Well, it is protected. We ain't got no vippins. Oh, boy. -o. The doctor's been down here with his dirty DNA again. Oh, fucking hell. Ah, okay. I can do this. I'm a big, brave man, bear cub boy. Do this. I can do this. Let me uh, chop up my, my old plutonium there. It's fucking Jurassic Park. Is it actual DNA vials? I can see another one over there. The fucking Jurassic Park DNA vials. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you, fighting and everything. What's that? What is smoke rain over there? Oh, it's a fire. Is that a... Oh, I thought it was a body at first. Just something that looked like it was being chained up. Okay. Have we got to do the power on switch? Oh, the Antichrist chamber. Oh, power. Yep, yeah, okay. Let's get the uh, fucking plutonium vial first. You say, me help. Me help. Oh, it's the wrong way around. Help me. Okay. I'm a coming. Uh huh. Yep. This is not a happy place. Yeah. Uh-huh. It is an actual body. It's an actual upside bloodly. Okay. Nothing in there. Oh, there is something in there. Can I get to it yet? Probably because of the red lights that's on. The wire appears to be broken. So how... If the wire's broken, then why is the light on? Oh, stop it with the music. Are you okay there? Um, you okay? You look like you got something in your mouth. You okay? Um, uh, just take that. Oh, it does, folks, and the flashlight consumes battery life and it will recharge over time. Cool. Thank you. I got the key. You hang tight now. I'll be back. I can't close you. Good. Don't think I'm going to be safe. I don't feel safe in here. Really don't feel safe. I am sorry, child. But you have been chosen. Only the That's way her. the Almighty can rid the world of the horror within. He has spoken to me. I am. Oh, why did I click it again? Only the will of God Almighty can rid the world of the horrors within. He has spoken to me. I am the messenger. And you, my dear, you are the vessel. That sounds like a pleasant party. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's a happy man, all right. Ah, there's a foos. That was a foos, eh? So I can switch it on now. Sklink. Okay. She better fucking come back up and chase me. I mean, I know I'm good looking and everything, but oh boy. I bet that's where she was killed and then dragged out there to be hanged up. That's the citizenship card. 
Okay. I'm gone. Gonna go. Nice to know you, honey. But something tells me you ain't gonna need your citizenship card anymore. Ah, yeah. Okay. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. Ooh. So there's a fucking monster in here now. Hello. Nope. Just the devil cat thing on its perch still. Okay, we're done. I have to fucking prepare myself for a jump scare just as we get to the door. Fuck off. Just preempting the warning now, just fuck off. Mm. 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 Fuck off. Nope, okay. Good, none. Is it night time? Is it spooping hour? No. Okay, well, it's good. And my crowbar changed into a cricket bat. That's some bad mojo right there. Okay, we got one at least. One piece of a ciders and ship card. All I can really do is search the other houses, but not right now. In this video, I'm gonna go back to the ATM. Oh, there's an invisible thing. Is that a ghost? Because I can hear her crying again. I'm, 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 okay, it's getting dark. Oh, it's getting dark. Good evening, residents. This is your man, Matt P.K. The time is 6 p.m. Please keep in your mind the adverse effect of an anonymous thunderstorm you have on them. Basically, let me GTFO and get inside. Got it. Um, I think I'm gonna do that. I'm going to go to the ATM and save my ass. I mean, I'm not going to go to the safe house, because fuck that shit. This is where the fun happens. This is the witching hour. Okay, we're safe. We're all happy and dandy in here. I'm going to check out the invisible thing. Okay, this will do. This will probably do more dabblage than a base uh, cricket bat. I want to go and check out that invisible thing. Very bad idea. Extremely bad idea. Where? 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 Oh. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Really bad idea. Extremely stupid bad idea. But I've just got this notion that once you've come across something and you know that if it can kill you or not, you know to avoid it in the future. Because at least something that's physical and it can be there and you can see it and you can see it move and you know it looks just fucked up weird, then at least you know to stay away. Oh, hi. <laughs> Hey. Oh man, there's a fuck off fly. That is such a bad idea. There's something there. Ah! Ooh! Ooh, it's spooky girl! Oh, that's awesome! Ah! Ah! Ooh! I knew it was a bad idea. Can I kill you? Can I kill you? Come on, let me kill you! Ooh! <laughs> Fucking awesome! You could not do that in the demo! Oh, oh wow! Oh, I so much want to play more of this, but the time for this is over. The video is done. I'm on our gun. At least we're going to have fun in the impact. The serious? You've been tainted. While tainting the darkness, we'll go temporary blind. Press space 
Choose your HTTP visual radar device. Be aware that audio waves will attract nearby animals. Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is fucked up. No, I gotta save. I gotta, gotta end it here. This is fucking cool. Anyway, I'm done. I really wanna play more. I'm done, my geek guys and guys. This is it. This is the end of the video. Can't wait for part three. I can't wait to play more of this game because this is fucking awesome sauce. Oh, brilliant. So, you know what to do. Good, do all that good YouTube stuff. Like if you like it. Dislike if you don't. If you want to smack a uh, comment below. <laughs> Damn burp hiccups. Bye bye. Smack a comment down below if you want to let me know what's on your mind. And don't forget, every Saturday I will be doing a live stream. Check me out on Twitter to know when those live streams are going to go go up live. And I'll see you in the next video. So bye bye for now. Dominator. I also downloaded a demo which has a similar kind of echolocation concept. I can't wait to play that one.